Hello, my friends. Thank you for joining us again today. Today, I want to talk to you about connection. I have in my hand a cord that connects a printer to a computer. You see, you have to have one of these unless you have wireless uh, a printer, but you still have to be connected on the internet in order to do that. A few years ago, I purchased a Mac computer and tried to connect it to the printer that I had and it would not connect. I had to have a certain connector, a certain wire in order to make that connection, adapter. See, Jesus is our connector to God. Back in the very beginning when God created Adam and Eve, they sinned and they were disconnected from God. They no longer had the power in that relationship that they once had. But in the New Testament, we see that God loved the world so much, John chapter 3, verse 16 tells us, that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believed in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. See, Jesus was the connector back to the Father. In fact, 1 Timothy chapter number 2, verse 5, Paul tells this young pastor, he says, For there is only one God and one mediator or connector between God and man, that is Christ Jesus. So I encourage you, to, my friend, today, if you've been disconnected from God, disconnected from His power because of sin in your life, because of disobedience, whatever it may be, if you feel disconnected, go to Jesus. He is our connector. Confess your sins and He is faithful and just to forgive you of your sins and to cleanse you from all unrighteousness and you can be reconnected with the Father. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.